hello everyone i am going to show you how to use matlab on your android phone at first open the play store app in the search box write matlab you will see matlab mobile Click on install. So MATLAB is installed already. So I'm going to open the MATLAB mobile. So click on open. And you will see this window. Click continue. So if you have already an account then you can log in with your email ID but if you don't have any account just create one I am going to create one so click on create one so I am going to use my temporary email address so I am going to paste it here first name continue you can see here verify your MathWorks account that means uh, already an email is sent to my uh, email ID that is uh, given here so I need to verify this email ID. so to verify the account I need to uh, log in my email ID so I'm going to check my email inbox so this is my temporary email address and here in the inbox uh, I can see there is a, an email so I'm going to open the email and I can see there is an email from MathWorks and here is an option verify your email click on this and uh, we can see your profile was verified now we can use MathWorks so now i need to return to my matlab app so now click on continue so now you need to set a password so i'm going to set a password Here, there are some instructions about password. It should be between 8 to 50 characters, at least one upper and lowercase letter, and at least one number. So, I have given the password uh, following these instructions. So, now I have to accept the online service agreement. So, just check the option over here and then click on continue. Now you can see a question over here do you have a matlab license there are two options yes and no so as i don't have matlab license so i will click on no you can see if you have matlab license you will get 5 gb of cloud storage on matlab drive if you don't have matlab license then you will receive 250 MB of cloud storage on MATLAB drive as I don't have a MATLAB license so I'm going to click on no
so it is connecting to MathWorks cloud so here two options over here continue and upgrade so if you want to unlock more features then you can upgrade or you can continue with this one so I'm going to continue click on continue so after that you will see this window and here is the option explore MATLAB examples so if I click on this you will see files commands sensors examples so you will see some examples of MATLAB code over here you can use sensors you can use commands and as well as you can write some script so I'm going to use command prompt now so I'm going to click commands and you can see this is the command prompt I can write MATLAB code over here MATLAB instructions over here so I'm going to write a equal to 5 so if I click so if I enter you can see a equal to 5 is shown so I'm going to write another instruction this hello so it is showing hello so this is the way you can use MATLAB command prompt on your Android phone also you can write your MATLAB script just click on here and go to files and you will see a folder you can also create a new folder over here just click on this plus sign and click on new folder so I'm going to name it my code click on create so I can see a folder named my code is already created so I'm going to open it just click on this my code then click on this plus sign new file then name it my code one dot m so this is the file name and I'm going to create a MATLAB file as we know the extension of MATLAB file is .m so I'm going to create this so I have set it my code 1.m now I'm going to click on create so inside the my code folder I have created one file that is my code 1.m now I am going to write the code in this file a equal to 5 b equal to 6 then c equal to a plus b now I am going to display the value of c DISP C on the top of the window you can see an option to run this code so click on this option and you can see my code 1 11 so my code is the file name and the 11 is the output after running the file so in this way you can use command prompt as well as you can use the script to run your MATLAB code over here so this is the thing you can do over here also if you have any figure if you want to show any figure in your MATLAB code you can see over here this is the option for figure if there is any figure as output then you can see 
the figure over here so this is how you can install matlab mobile uh, on your android phone and you can create your matlab script and you can also run the file on your android phone now i'm going to show you how to read an image and display that image as well so go to your folder where you have written your code click on plus sign then upload photos and go to files i'm going to upload this one make sure you have the internet connection because if you want to run this matlab mobile you need to be connected in the internet so book.jpg is already in my current folder so if i write my code over here img equal to i am read so my file name is book dot jpeg so this is my file name so i'm going to read it then i will display so this is my file book.jpg now i'm going to display this one to display an image we need to use i am show so i'm show i am g now if i run this code it will show me the image now you can see the image is displayed here you can also click on this figure to see the output image you can see the figure over here this is the output image so in this way you can also uh, input an image and you can show the image as well you can also see the value of 11 it is the value of c i hope it would be helpful for you Thank you, John.